Right. <laughs> Another embarrassing question. <laughs> Does anything make you blush? Uh, lots of things. I blush quite easily. I can feel it now, actually. Just, yeah, Are you heating people up? looking at me, stop it. <laughs> okay, right. <laughs> A report out today says going red is nature's way of keeping humans honest because we have to communicate our true feelings. Here's Arige de Fuiche. We blush when we're embarrassed, feeling guilty, or when we do something we're ashamed of. It's the body's way of revealing what we're really thinking. On our first date, we went walking on Hampstead Heath and I chipped in a rabbit hole and I blushed then. <laughs> I don't remember that. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's true. <laughs> I'm a hairdresser and I had a client who I thought was pregnant. Um, so I asked her and she was like, obviously, no. So that was very embarrassing. Blushing has to do very much with the fear that we're going to reveal something about ourselves that we'd rather not show. We fear that people are going to evaluate us negatively if we blush. Jen Archer can't stop herself blushing. Falling over, talking to strangers or speaking in public all raise her anxiety levels. No, guys. No, don't count me down. But experts say if, like Jen, you're afraid of performing in public, the best thing to do is go ahead and Mama do it. Mia, here I go again. My, my, how can I resist you? Mamma Mia. No shame at all. Uh, joined now by Emma Connor, who is a blusher. I'm surrounded by blushing Emmas. What a morning <laughs> oh, we're having lucky here. Man. I am. I'm doing very, very well. Good morning to morning. you. Um, you've, you've been a blusher for, for, for a long time, and it hasn't always been easy to, uh, no, to live with, has it? No, what, what was no. it like when you were younger? Um, well, I kind of suffer with social anxiety, and that's mm. why I sort of blushed, because I was sort of worried about what people thought about my opinions and what I had to say. Um, and sort of in school, if I was asked a question by a teacher, that is the worst, though, isn't it, in school, when they put you on the spot yeah, and you yeah. really don't know the answer and you're trying to find your way out. Yeah, or sometimes I did know the answer, but just everyone's attention on me just made me go red and I started beating myself up and mm. just a downward spiral, really. And did that happen right from the word go in school? Um, when you were very, very young? Is it an so. early experience that could have triggered this? It could be, but I just remember in the first class in school, I couldn't answer my name to the register. I don't know really? why. But <laughs> Something just held you back. So yeah, how do you yeah. go about dealing with that in, a, in, in social situations now mm. or, or, or professional situations as well? How do you deal mm. with it? Um, well, I've sort, of, I've sort of kind of, well, more or less recovered from it. Um, I found a social anxiety support group in 2005, um, and I went along to that and met other people that felt just like I did. And that was my first stepping stone to sort of getting over it. I'd never heard of social anxiety okay. disorder before. But, it, but it, it's there, it's out yeah, there, and there's yeah. actually a support group. And what do so, they say, first of all, to you to, to sort of help you get over it? Um, what, blushing or social anxiety? Yeah, do, or? Yeah, what's the difference? Um, I think they're all interlinked. I think because when you're anxious, you're just so worried what people think. Mm. That I d not everyone gets it, but a way it, your nervousness comes out is that you go red yes. because you can see that people are seeing who you really are, an aspect of your personality. Yes, that vulnerability, yeah, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah. Very, mm. very, yeah, very, very awkward. Yeah. A and techniques for coping? Um, with blushing, mm. yeah. Um, well, I think um, one of... Sorry, Nick, who ran the support group, he sort of told us about how to sort of let our feelings just move through us. Cause yes. Sometimes if we try and fight them, it just makes it worse. So let it all just flow out. Yeah, and just yeah, yeah. God, what a relief it must have been to have, <laughs> to have met people who had similar it problems was, in, yeah. the, in, in that particular group. Yeah, and yeah. do you dance now as well I to do. express yourself? Yeah, I start... I mean, that can be, and yeah. I do know this, that can be terribly <laughs> humiliating. <laughs> can I? I, yeah, but you found it a real release of yeah, expression, yeah. didn't yeah. you? Yeah, good at dancing there, Emma. Mm. I mean, you're not saying <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly yeah. right. What are we saying here? <laughs> No, did you? What, 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 what made you sort of get into that? Um, I think I'd always wanted to do it, but I wasn't at a place in my life where I was confident enough to go and find a class. But yeah. I just found it on the internet and just went along and just really enjoyed it from the first lesson. God. So let's carry You've on. You've got to teach me that secret. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank you very much indeed, uh, Emma, for coming in this morning. What's this here? <laughs> 